Yo, what is up my baked potatoes? What's up guys? It's GlitchGuide420 here today and I'm bringing you guys a money glitch, a solo money glitch guys. Uh, so this was uploaded on 7 Sins on Friday. Sorry, I didn't have time to upload it on Friday. But yeah, I'm uploading it tonight. And I'm going to have the founders links in the description as well as the link to the 7 Sins post. Um, Honestly, I can't pronounce all the names, so I'm not going to bother trying, guys. And like always, guys, if you can comment and like my videos, it really helps me out. I do read all your comments. And if you're new to the channel, go ahead and subscribe and turn on post notifications. So for this glitch, guys, you're going to need a facility. If you don't have one, grind some heists or do something to make some money so you can get one. Because this solo duplication glitch is really easy, guys. So the first things first, guys, make sure, you know, if you use a Deluxo or a Depressor to get over here, that you don't, you return that before you start. Because it's going to dupe over the last vehicle you had on the map, guys, and I don't want any of you duping over, you know, your expensive vehicles. Because that would really suck. Now, guys, in the video, you see I called out my Fagio, I went and got it, and I drove over to my facility, and, and then I, you know, sat there for a little while and then returned it. You don't really have to do that guys, you just have to call out the Fagio. You can leave it out or you can return it. It really doesn't make a difference when you do the glitch. Uh, I've done it both ways. So as you're gonna see here in a moment, I'm gonna get off the Fagio and I'm gonna return it to storage. But like I said, if you wanna leave it out, it doesn't matter. Also, if you wanna use elegies, free elegies, you can, but the Fagios are easier to call out. So from here you're going to open up your phone and go to quick job and you're going to go to the doomsday heist right at the top and join on call. Now you're going to wait here until you see uh, the lobby saying what job you're going to join and like a number like you know two out of four, one out of four, whatever. Now you can hold your phone out and wait for, to hear the noise or you can put it down. Now see as soon as I saw those numbers I went to quick job. And then I backed out. I didn't click on any of the quick jobs. I just went to quick job in my phone, pressed triangle to back out real quick and walked into the facility. That's it. Once you do that, guys, you're not going to have the little loading circle in the bottom right corner and you're glitched out. That's it. Uh, and the best part about this, you only have to do this part once, guys. That's it. Uh, after that, you can dupe as many cars as you want until you fall asleep, guys. You can dupe as many cars as you want, as many cars as you can store. I recommend using Fagios, guys. It's going to make things way easier to call out. Um, Elegies, if you're broke, go ahead and use Elegies, guys. Uh, but you will notice that at a certain point, you won't be able to use your mechanic. But I'll show you guys how to fix that in a little bit. All right, so once you guys get in here, it's really simple. You're going to be able to drive your car around which is really cool guys in and of itself you're gonna be able to drive the cars around your facility anywhere you want so you want to go and you want to have either an LG retro custom or assault and rs or any other benny's car guys that you have that you can do but if you don't have enough money for an LG, just make sure it's a benny's car guys because they're going to sell for the most they're going to sell for the full price and they won't get you dupe detected because they're not dirty. Uh, when you dupe a supercar, guys, make sure you just sell the original and keep the duplicate because the duplicate will not be worth selling. It won't sell for the full price, which will make it dirty. All right, so what you wanna do is you wanna basically park it so the mirror, see how the driver's side mirror is right against the edge there? That's perfect. And when you get out, you are going to get out the passenger side. So you're gonna park your car exactly where I did next to that yellow circle. And next to that pole you're gonna run and grab another car that's inside of here it can be any car guys i just happen to have all elegies in here and as i showed you guys the one i'm using to duplicate has uh blank plates this one does not um but as this is not the plates that's going to be on your car it's actually gonna be the plates from the fagia that we took out earlier but all your duplicates guys are going to have fresh plates like that so you want to go and you just want to park it right against the door guys like that and that way you're blocking off the passenger side door now when you press triangle guys you're just going to teleport in the car so now i'm just testing it you want to make sure you can teleport really fast and what you want to do is hit triangle and x at the same time guys now you can spam it a couple times really fast or i think it works even if you just hit them both at the same time what's going to happen is you're going to spawn outside in the car with as you guys can see a brand new plate 
Now what you want to do is you want to request your mobile operations center and make your way over there and park it in the back. That will save your duplicate guys. If you don't do that, um, it's very important if your car gets blown up or destroyed or you go and put it in your garage, it's going to turn back into a fag, you guys. You want to make sure you put it in the back of your MOC. Now you don't have to drive it in and out of your MOC multiple times. You only have to drive it in there once. But as you guys are going to see here, I like to drive it in, drive it out, and return it through the motorcycle club just to be 100% sure that it sticks. Now another thing guys is sometimes when you do the glitch, uh, you might miss the X and triangle at the same time and you might actually spawn out on foot. If that happens, it's no big deal. Go back in, set up your cars again, and try it again. So now as you guys are going to see here, I was trying to think of which would be the best way to get back to the MOC. It doesn't matter how you guys want to do it. You guys, if you guys can call out a car, that's great. But see here, I could not call out my mechanic and get any cars. I could call him up, but I couldn't get any cars. He said it wasn't available during mission. I couldn't call Moore's Mutual or anything. Uh, so what I did is I called out a Fagio to make sure I had the Fagio as the last vehicle. I returned it. And as you're going to see in a moment, I actually went and I used the Lester invite for the new heist in our facility to teleport back to the facility. I was told, uh, and actually if you guys do join any other jobs, you know, you will actually lose the glitch. You won't be glitched out anymore and you'll have to do the first part again. But as you guys are going to see here, something I didn't know, I just discovered when I was doing it. When you use this Lester invite, you spawn in, you're kind of glitched out, but everything will pop back up. And as you can see in that little circle where the, uh, uh, where usually you have a crew logo, that's not even there. So, um, I was like, all right, it looks like I'm still glitched out. So I went up and I said, oh, I'll test it guys. And I was able to drive a car around. So perfect guys. It's a really quick and easy way to get back. Now, the other thing I noticed out of this, once you do this guys, it unlocks your mechanic. So you can call your mechanic. If you want to use free elegies, you can go ahead and walk outside, call your mechanic call up your elegy and use that guys so if you want to do that that's fine so i'm going to use the blank plate again guys just so you can see that it transfers the plate uh the new plate onto it so <clears throat> i'm going to go ahead and do the same thing we did before and i'm going to sh you know explain things again now as you guys are going to see here uh when i first go to line this up i do it way too far and if you do that guys you're going to end up teleporting into the car but it's going to be behind where the circle isn't and you don't want that guys so i pulled up too far as you can see my mirror is way past that pole you really want your mirror to be just right by that pole right by the end of that pole there and see how the mirror is right there just touching it that's perfect guys all right guys so again you're going to grab your second car and again, it doesn't matter what it is, but I happen to have all allergies in here. And you're gonna go ahead and block off that passenger side door. That way, when you teleport in and out, you're gonna be right in front of the yellow circle. So, all right, as you guys can see here, um, it's a little bit tricky driving around here with all the obstacles. <laughs> all right, so you just park it just like that, guys. And again, you want to make sure that when you're teleporting in and out, you're standing in front of that circle and you want to hit X and triangle at the same time. I usually spam it like twice really fast guys. Uh, but yeah, and what you'll see is you're going to get in the car and then you're going to start hitting the keypad to go outside and then you'll spawn in your car. So as you guys are going to see here, when I do that, it's just going to spawn me really quick in the car and then boom, I'm hitting the keypad. So that's exactly what you're looking for if you guys get that you hit it okay and when you spawn outside boom you're in the car and look at that guys we got a numbered plate brand new plate fresh plate clean dupe all right guys now again i'm gonna fast forward to when i drive in the moc Now, as you guys are going to see here, I forgot to call out my mobile operation center. So I'm just going to go ahead and request it. And you want to make sure you're driving away from where it normally spawns and facing away from it. And it will spawn behind you guys. You don't have to be far away from it. You just can't be facing where it normally spawns. So once you hear that little ding, get the little message on the left side, top left side, you just go ahead and drive back where your MOC should spawn and go ahead and drive it in that simple guys so if you do forget don't worry it's really simple to get spawn next to you all right so now you're just going to drive it in again and again 
you can just leave it in there or you can drive it out and return it to storage that's what i like to do guys just because i like to be 100 percent you know how it is guys 420 life you get a little paranoid so yeah all right guys i'm just kidding though i'm not paranoid all right so we're gonna go ahead and uh yeah i actually walked out on foot and then i thought oh i'm gonna drive out just to be safe even though again guys you really don't have to do that all right so from there again guys once you do that you just go ahead get out return it to storage use your motorcycle club if you're getting fagios or call your mechanic guys because you can now do that um, and get an LG but again guys I am using fagios so once the fagio is out I'm gonna go ahead and accept the Lester invite again guys you don't have to return the fagio uh, you can actually leave it out it doesn't matter so again I use the Lester invite guys it teleports me here everything's black for like a second sometimes it's not but it don't worry about that guys all right, so that's it for me, guys. I'm GlitchGuy420, and I'm out.